ഗുഡ് മോർണിംഗ് ഐ ആം ഡേവിഡ് അസിസ്റ്റൻറ്റ് പ്രൊഫസർ ഡിപ്പാർട്ട്മെൻറ്റ് ഓഫ് മെക്കാനിക്കൽ എഞ്ചിനീയറിംഗ് റോഗണി കോളേജ് ഓഫ് എഞ്ചിനീയറിംഗ് ആൻഡ് ടെക്നോളജി ഇൻ ദിസ് വീഡിയോ ഐ ആം ഗോയിങ് ടു ടീച്ച് ദ ട്രബിൾ ഷൂട്ടിംഗ് മെത്തേഡ്സ് ഓഫ് ഹൈട്രോളിക് സിസ്റ്റംസ് വിച്ച് ഇസ് അവൈലബിൾ ഇൻ ദ ഫോർത്ത് യൂണിറ്റ് ഓഫ് ഹൈട്രോളിക്സ് ആൻഡ് നിമാറ്റിക് സബ്ജെക്ട് ആസ് പെർ ഓഫ് സിലബസ് ഓർ ഫിഫ്ത് യൂണിറ്റ് ഈസ് ട്രബിൾ ഷൂട്ടിംഗ് ആൻഡ് ആപ്ലിക്കേഷൻസ് So these are the some common causes for hydraulic system breakdown. First one is clogged and dirty oil filters. If the thickness of the fluid or liquid becomes uh, very high, these things will be happen. Blockage of oil may be happen and dirty oil filters. Then inadequate, an inadequate supply of oil in the reservoir. leaking seals loose inlet lines which cause pump cavitations and eventual pump damage some collapse of bubbles uh, because of that pump may damage incorrect type of oil so suppose we have selected a, um, incorrect type of oil means damage or breakdown may be occur in the hydraulic system excessive oil oil temperature excessive oil pressure these are the some common causes for hydraulic system breakdown next some list of hydraulic system operating problems and the probable causes so these are the common problems first one noisy pump so pump noise may be uh, occur due to this following problems this causes first one air entering into the pump inlet so in the inside the pump fluid uh, liquid only must be enter suppose the oil uh, air enters means noise may be occur misalignment of the pump excessive oil viscosity dirty inlet strainer shattering relief valve damaged pump excessive pump speed loose or damaged inlet these are some causes for this problem the so second problem lower erratic pressure the causes are first air in the fluid pressure relief valve set too low pressure relief valve not properly seated leak in the hydraulic system defective or worn out pump defective or worn out actuator these are the causes of this problem then third problem is low pressure pump rotating in the wrong direction ruptured hydraulic line low oil level in the reservoir pressure relief valve malfunctioning full pump flow by bypassed to the tank due to faulty valve these are the causes of this problem fourth problem is actuator fails to move the causes are faulty pump direction control valve fails to shift system pressure is too low defective actuator pressure relief valve stuck open actuator load is excessive check valve installed in the reservoir uh, in the reverse direction then fifth problem is slow or erratic motion of the actuator the causes are air in the system high viscosity of the fluid worn out damaged pump pump speed too low excessive leakage through actuators faulty or dirty flow control valves then sixth problem is overheating of hydraulic fluid the causes the causes are heat exchanger turned out turned off or blocked undersized components or piping incorrect fluid continuous operation of pressure relief valve overloaded system dirty fluid reservoir is too small inadequate supply of oil in the reservoir excessive pump speed so these are the problems and causes then 
the remedies for hydraulic system for the, for some problems the first problem is excessive noise so for this problem we can make this type of remedies replace dirty filters and clean strainers clog the inlet line and reservoir breather change fluid switch over the proper pump speed and overall replace supercharger pump fill reservoir to the liquid bleed air from the system and plug leakages into the line replace pump shaft seal or shaft condition of bearings seals and couplings to be checked and the unit aligned pressures to be corrected the second problem is excessive heat the remedies for this replace dirty filters and clean clogged inlet line and reservoir breather change fluid switch over to proper pump and overall replace supercharger pump fill reservoir to liquid level bleed air from the system and plug leakages into the inlet line replace pump shaft seal or sh shaft condition of bearings seals and couplings to be checked and the unit aligned the third problem is incorrect flow the remedies are tighten leakly connections and carry out bleeding of the system check for pump and pump drive damage replace and align coupling adjust or overall or replace check position of manually operated controls check electrical circuit of solenoid controls repair or replace pilot pressure pump Re reverse the direction of rotation the fourth problem is incorrect pressure the remedies may be change dirty filters replace hydraulic fluid tighten leaky connection fill reservoir to proper level and carry out bleeding of the system gas valve to be checked for leakage charged to correct pressure and overall if defect defective adjust overall or replace the fifth problem is faulty operation the remedies may be cold state of the fluid check the cold state of the fluid viscosity of the fluid also to be checked and if found improper replace with the fluid having correct viscosity locate bind and repair adjust repair or replace clean adjust or replace check system fluid condition and also condition for filters overall or replace repair command console or interconnecting wires lubricate the components properly adjust repair or replace counter balance valve so these are the some uh, problems causes and remedies for the hydraulic system failure thank you